E aí moçada, quem tá falando aqui é o Bruno. Nesse vídeo vamos jogar só mais 5 minutos de A Golden Wake. Bom, no episódio passado a gente conseguiu pegar os planos do concorrente do George Merrick. E não conseguimos comprar aquele terreno. É... Mas a gente fez amiz... tá faz... tentando fazer amizade com a repórter lá e ela que eu acho que vai nos ajudar nisso. Só que pra... Pra isso a gente tem que ajudá-la e para ajudá-la a gente tem que entrar num, naquele clube lá de é para pessoas ricas e a gente não tem acesso. Provavelmente o George Merrick vai nos dar acesso aí depois de entregar os planos. Vamos ver. Hum, então vamos direto na na sala do rapaz. Come in. Hello, Mr. Merrick. Thanks. A pleasure to see you. Please, have a seat. Sempre. Bom, eu já tenho os planos. Here you are, Mr. Merrick. I got your design plans back from Riley. Very impressive work, Banks. Did you get the job, too? I'm not quite sure about that, sir. <laughs> well, for the time being, let's hope you didn't. I don't want Riley stealing anything else from me. Um, joining the men's club. I was wondering if I could ask a favor of you. What might that be? I'm trying to join the Miami men's club, and I need someone to vouch for me. A society climber on your first day in town? It's not quite like that. I understand. Sometimes this business makes us do things we weren't expecting. You're telling me. Very well. Give me one moment and I'll have Miss Rogers type up a letter for you. Estou fazendo isso para você agora. Obrigado, Mr. Merrick. Um prazer. Vamos falar sobre publicidade, então. O que é sobre a sua necessidade de publicidade? Qualquer projeto, não importa o quão bom ele é, é doomed para falar e ninguém sabe sobre isso. Eu consegui conseguir um pouco de bom advertising, mas eu acho que precisamos de algo mais. A história de Coral Gables precisa fazer as notícias. Eu gostaria de você ir para o Miami Herald e ver se você pode se conhecer um repórter. Agora estou lembrando. Ter um jornalista no nosso corner faria maravilhas para o nosso advertising. Eu vou rodar o que? É o cara lá que a gente tentou comprar? Nós temos uma história com o todo isso. Há uma estrada de terra que é um grande interesse para mim. Eu estou pensando em fazer uma coisa assim. 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 Eu estou pensando em fazer u
It looks like you, with a mustache. If I may be frank, I'm glad you shaved it off. It doesn't really suit you. That's my father, Hiram Banks. He was one of the top real estate moguls in the Northeast. Surely that demonstrates I have some sort uh -huh. of pedigree. Ah, of course. While I have to admit I've never heard of the man, we have several members who surely have being in that field. Very good. The club will take this into consideration when evaluating your membership application. Don't uh, vouch. Have a look at this. It's a letter from George Merrick sponsoring my entry into your club. Merrick, eh? Well, he is a fairly prestigious member of the community. Very good. The club will take this into consideration when evaluating your membership application. Well, you seem to have provided sufficient information to be considered for membership into this club. Now it's just a matter of your evaluation. How long will that take? Oh, it all depends. Likely a week or two. We'll contact you when the decision has been made. I'm not sure I can wait that long. In that case, there may be ways of expediting the process. Mm. How is that? I believe this is how we do it. Say, friend, you've really been a great help today. I'd like to give you a little something for your trouble. Huh. Why, thank you, Mr. Banks. Ah. Well, what do you know? It seems the results of your evaluation are in, and you've passed with flying colors. Oh dear, sir. Welcome to the Miami Men's Club. Please feel free to use any of the club's amenities at your leisure. And of course, if there's anything I can do for you, please let me know. Begging your pardon, my good man? Yes? Are you familiar with a gentleman by uh -huh. the name of Jeremiah Miller? Yes, I am. He's a member of this club. In fact, He's in the lounge right now. Okay. What can you tell me about him? He runs in very elite political circles, but that's about as much as I know. On a personal level, well, I really shouldn't be saying this. Nobody else will know. My lips are sealed. From what I've gathered, he's not particularly well liked by other club members. It's on account of being such a blue nose, always harping about the sins of alcohol. Of course, he's not exactly on the level himself, but I've really said too much. I hmm. think you've said just enough. My thanks. I'm afraid I must be going. Good day to you, sir. May I take your hat, sir? Yes, of course. Much appreciated. Hmm. Well, look at this, boys. It seems we've got a new member. Mm, but my okay. They all seem to be rather uncomfortable. Okay. Come on in, my boy. There's no need to be shy. What's your name, and where are you coming from? Alfred Banks, from New York. Just relocated to Miami this morning. I must say, you work fast, Banks. Just arrived, and already a member of one of the best men's clubs in town. You must really be the cat's pajamas. <laughs> well, I... But where are my manners? I'm Jeremiah Miller, county commissioner. District 2. Pleasure. I welcome you not only to the club, but to our fair city as well. Thank you, sir. Feel free to make yourself at home and get to know the others. If you have any questions about the city or anything else, I'll be happy to help. Okay. You will see. Good book? Okay. Yes, it's got a key. Pardon me, sir, but... <laughs> Don't think I'm talking to Jeremiah Miller. Jeremiah Miller. Mr. Miller? What can I help you with, Banks? Okay, fala sobre você. So, you're a county commissioner. Indeed, I am. What does that entail exactly? Well, I won't bore you with the particulars, but basically I'm one of several elected officials who run the county. It's not a bad jumping point if you, like me, are interested in furthering your political career. Your best bet is to find a platform and rally up supporters. After that, climbing the ladder is duck soup. Oh, my game is real estate, not politics. You mean there's a difference? <laughs> 
We're both out to screw the next chump over. <laughs> Why, our fields are practically brothers! Isn't that a bit cynical, sir? Oh, it's a necessary quality in this business, my friend. Now, don't dismiss my idea so easily, Banks. You've got the makings of a politician in you. I wouldn't be surprised to see you in office somewhere within the next few years. Uh, finally sobre Miami. Have you lived here long? About 20 years, in fact. This city has grown considerably since then, and I'm proud to be involved in its government. Okay. Sobre os outros know anything members. about the other club members? They seem a bit cold. Nah, don't let them get to you. They're just a bit shy around new members. Soon enough, they'll warm up to you, and they'll be like your second family. In any case, the bookworm over there is Carlton Meeks. Carlton Meeks. From what I understand, he's in the real estate game. Hmm. The two gents over there are John Norris Sr. and Junior. And Junior. Not a day goes by, they aren't in here having some sort of squabble. And finally, the esteemed gentleman leaning on the counter is Franklin Evans. Don't think I've seen his face in years. He tends to keep to himself, you see. They're not the liveliest bunch, but uh, they'll grow on you. Mr. Miller, this may be none of my business, but I was just trying to talk to the fellow over there by the counter, and, well, he's got a very strong scent of alcohol on him. I felt a bit woozy just standing next to him. You don't say. I suppose that would explain quite a bit. This won't do. No, sir, not at all. Excuse me a moment, won't you, Banks? Evans, are you drunk? Evans, answer me. Good Lord, how much have you had? You're a hazard. What if I wanted to light a cigarette? You're a disgrace to the good name of this club. Okay, <laughs> okay. Engraved flask. Jeremiah Mala. Oh. Falo de álcool, mas tá aí, ó. Não, quero ver. Não. There's more engraved silver flask. Seem to be quite full. Então, tá cheio. É prateado. E, tirando a tampa, eu sinto um cheiro inconfundível de álcool. Então o safado fica falando de contra álcool, mas tá lá bebendo. Bom. É, é a prova que eu precisava pra menina lá do jornal. Okay. Your hat, sir. Thank you. Bora pro jornal. Miami Herald. MS Douglas. May I have a moment? You may. I'll see you around. Count on it. Mm. Don't I? Ship. Toma. Have a look at this. It's Jeremiah Miller's engraved flask. So my hunch was right after all. Mm -hmm. Nice work, Banks. It's a bit of a tenuous link, but it's probably the best we'll be able to do at this point. Well, a deal's a deal. You can go ahead and tell Merrick I'll write for him. I appreciate your help, Miss Douglas. Agora eu preciso de descobrir. Uma forma de fazer esse cara vender. You again? What do you want? Hum. Sir, I really just want to have a chat. I know your game. You vipers are just trying to trick me, and before I know it, you'll be flim-flamming me into signing some paper handing over my land. Well, you can just forget it. I've worked too hard on this house to just let it go. The paperwork alone was a nightmare and a half. Nothing you can say will convince me to sell my land. Nothing. Good day to you, sir. E aqui, como é que será? Ó, oh, deixa eu voltar lá, às vezes... Aparece alguma opção, pega algum item... Ah, como é que eu vou fazer esse cara vender? Ah, 
Vamos lá. Come in. Hello, Mr. Merrick. Thanks. A pleasure to see you. Please have a seat. Vai, senta aí, rapaz. I'll just get to it then. I wish you the best of luck. Tá. Bom, vamos voltar no hotel. Ver se eu tenho alguma coisa que eu deixei para trás ali no quarto que possa me ajudar com isso. Não. Vai ser alguma coisa lá na própria casa, mas aquela hora eu olhei e não vi nada. Ah, Hall of Records. Excuse me. What can I do for you? Request Could I look record. something up? Of course. What do you need? There's a house at Isso. 1251 Anastasia Avenue that I need some information on. Of course. Let me go have a look. Yes, here we are. Belongs to one Ernest Mathers. Built it himself six months ago. Might I have a copy of the document? What's your business with it? I'm working with Mr. George Merrick of the Coral Gables Project, and it's of utmost importance to his acquisition of the land. All right, you can take this copy. Thank you for your help. Anytime. Aí, ó. Agora sim. Nós pegamos uma cópia do do registro lá do, da casa do cara. Deixa eu ver. Consigo ver? Hum... Foi construída seis meses atrás pelo Ernest Matters. Cursory Inspection Perform. Cursory. Não sei o que é uma Cursory Inspection. Hum. Opa, looking for the see that permits pilot for any of the construction work done. Então na verdade ele não tem nenhum. ele não tem permissão para ter construído lá. Então, é assim que a gente vai conseguir o lugar lá. <risos> tá aí, ó. É. You again? What do you want? Não, eu não vou usar o record agora. Sir, não. I really just want to have a chat. I you ah, well, né? I the paper not good day. Tem que usar logo de cara, então. Vamos lá. Eu quero te mostrar isso aqui. Mr. Mathers, I've just been to the Hall of Records downtown and I pulled up a copy of your house record. Yes, and it seems you had a property inspection done when you completed the house, but it was very basic. Furthermore, you didn't pull any construction permits. I didn't need to. I haven't done any exterior work. Nevertheless, I'm afraid I'll need to perform an inspection of your home just as a matter of record. On what authority? Look, you can either let me come in and do a brief home inspection, or I can report you to the county, and you can deal with whatever fine or punishment they see fit to dispense. Ah, uh, fine. Come in. I don't know what you expect to find, though. Search the room for the violations listed at the bottom. Então, procurar o quarto pela... Pelas violações estão escritas aqui embaixo. Click on the spot where you think you have found one. If you are correct, the area will be marked. Se eu tiver certo, eu vou clicar onde eu achar que tem um problema. Se eu tiver certo, é, a área vai ser marcada com um círculo vermelho e o item vai desaparecer da lista. E eu tenho que achar todos. Huh. Ok. Então vamos lá. O que é isso aqui no chão? Cracked tile. Your floor tiles are severely cracked here. Do you regularly have elephants as house guests? <laughs> no. I mean, my mother-in-law hasn't seen the new house yet. <laughs> okay. That was a joke. Eu sei. I'm sure it was. <laughs> um. 
Okay, loose tile. Opa, tem um negócio aqui. O que, que é isso? Univen Retters. E liga o gazebo. Nice gazebo. I hope you know you need to have a permit to have one of those. It was a wedding gift from my sister. How was I meant to know? Ignorance of rules is no excuse, Mr. Mathers. Tá. Hmm. Old baseboard. Que que é isso aqui? Vamos ver. Your fireplace seems to be letting go of some of its tiles. Os tiles. Oh, okay. yes. I've been meaning to fix those. Aqui é... Muff. This wall shows clear signs of water damage. Ah, water you probably have a cracked pipe somewhere back there. Oh, I suppose that would explain it. Então esse aqui é o Muff. Quite a nasty build up of mold you have here. Uh, my wife told me she'd clean it up. Hmm, faltam três. Ok. O bom do point and click é, é isso. Aqui tem um. Você não tem... Hoje em dia os jogos você passa o mouse e ele já muda de cor, o troço fica brilhando no chão, não. Aqui você tinha que procurar mesmo. Aqui, ó, aqui tem alguma coisa. These Old baseboards look like they were installed during the Roosevelt administration. No, no, they're supposed to look like that. It's the style, makes them seem classic. Aham, uh aham. -huh. Uh -huh. eu nem sei o que é o Niven Retters pra descobrir. Ah, isso aqui não era Water Leaks? Hmm. Okay. Uneven rafters are quite the hazard. This whole roof could come tumbling down on you. Haven't had any problems so far. Um, falta um o vazamento de água. Achei que era esse. Devia ter um cracked pipe e eu não vi. Onde que a gente vai ver um vazamento de água se não aquele? Hum. Difícil achar esse vazamento de água. Só aqui, né? Aqui, ó. Uma água no chão aqui. What a mess! You clearly have a problem with a water leak. And I've called the plumber, but he's yet to get back to me. You seem to have several problems in this home. Are you sure you performed a thorough inspection? Well, yes. Yeah, I'm sure I did. I see. And who was it that performed this inspection exactly? Why, it was a, a man. Yes, a man from the city. And did you happen to get this man's name? Well, no, I, uh, I wasn't aware of... You didn't really have an inspection performed, did you? No. I paid someone to say they had done one on the public record. You won't tell anyone, will you? You're in quite a state here, Mr. Mathers. Not only did you build this house without the proper permits, but you also put fraudulent information on your report. This doesn't look good any way you cut it. Please, I, I have money. How much to get you to look the other way? I'm afraid my silence can't be bought, Mr. Mathers. However, you might be able to get yourself out of this jam if you sell your house and land to Mr. Merrick. Hey. So this is what it's come to. I see how it is. You come in here playing the White Knight, but you're no better than any of the rest of them. I did what I had to do to keep my land, but I suppose that was all for naught. Fine. I'll call up Mr. Merrick and tell him he's won. I hope you can live with yourself, you snake. I'm sure I'll manage. Have a nice afternoon, sir. Hmm. Mal feito, feito. Bora pro George Merrick. Bora.
Come in. Hello, Mr. Merrick. Thanks. A pleasure to see you. I believe that's everything taken care of, Mr. Merrick. You know, when you first walked through that door, I had a feeling there was something special about you. I'm glad to see my assumptions were well placed. Welcome aboard the Golden Galleon, Banks. Aye, yeah. I think you're going to do wonders for us. The Golden Galleon, sir? Yes, it's our new slogan. Dammers came up with it. Follow the Golden Galleon to Coral Gables, where your castles in Spain are made real. It certainly has a ring to it. Hmm. That it does. Now then, there's no time to waste. I've got some big plans for the next few years, and I'm going to need all the help I can get. Ok. Então, com isso nós completamos o capítulo 2. Um ano, nem um ano, né? Uma temporada de espaço. Mas... How are those sales going, Banks? Not bad, Doc. Just made another 12 this hour. I knew there was something special about you the minute you stepped off that train. Uma estação. Say, Doc, espaço. this new office is great and all, but aren't we a bit crowded in this room? You'll get used to it, kiddo. It's just that in New York, I wasn't... Well, this isn't New York, as I'm sure you've noticed by now. Anyway, George wants to see you in his office ASAP. I see. Thanks for letting me know. Muito bem. Vou encerrar. Uh, vou encerrar por aqui. E no próximo episódio a gente vê o que, que vem por aí. Um abraço e até a próxima.